YouTube welcome to the part where we finally got the hinges on the door latch and the air vent lever I think that's in camera it's a half inch wrench that's a little plastic knob I had it sprays on the nut I'll have pictures of that I'll have close-up pictures of the hinges uh, this is six inches long I have the measurements of that this is one of those plastic knob balls I have that I drilled a hole in. And we epoxied a threaded rod in there, which was just a long carriage bolt. We had some washers to space it out, double netted it. There's our door gasket. I better mention that. This is like 330 seconds thick. It's over a sixteenth of an inch. And I'll have a picture of that. It's bent, heated, bent. And you can adjust it. You can always heat this and bend this in and out. Also, there is a washer between here and the door so it don't scrape the paint. And if you can add another washer, you'd make it tighter. And we want to show you difference in door gasket material. I don't know if I can get a close-up I can take a picture. This has a coarser weave to it, the black stuff. We chose this. It's a little bit finer, uh, whatever you'd call it, woven. Same size, 5 8 So we chose this. It looks like it's just a little bit nicer stuff than other stuff but just so coarse it look in uh, my other stove it kind of fell apart a little bit so we chose that this will have fire brick in it these are about an inch and a quarter tall <clears throat> four and a half by nine we're gonna have to curve some with a uh, masonry blade in the grinder and we'll have a, that'll be in the next, another video so it'll put it about we figured it's a little over two and a half inches. We can get down to it. A little over two and a half inches from this up to the bottom of this. So we always keep our stove with the ashes to the back. So we're not gonna have to worry about the ashes building up too much in the front coming out. I know that's kind of shallow there, but I did want some room on the top here so the smoke didn't try to come back out the door we really shouldn't show that but we will before we're done we'll give you a short clip we decided to put our pipe in the middle comments suggestions are welcome on that but that's what we decided to do okay kind of turn it around here you can see how this piece of metal goes here, bent, welded underneath. Simple. Works good. Like I said, you can always adjust it. Adjust by heating bend it or put another washer under here. We'll make it thicker so it compresses that. We did have a weight on here now. We had over 10 pounds of weight, about 15 pounds of weight on here when we welded our hinges on. So we had this sunk in pretty good. So as I said, we have plenty of pictures. of all these parts and a few measurements so we don't want to make the video too long by talking about it but there you go that's the progress so far door gasket door hinges door latch and the lever for the air intake so thanks for watching